meet again. All right, please go ahead. Okay, so what? Who in the class has come across the idea of saying so what before? Gosh, really? Okay, so there's a few of you. And the nice thing about so what is it's a challenging question. It's what we call precision questioning level one. There are five levels of precision questioning. So what is very powerful because it cuts through all the crap. It cuts through all the stuff that we've been seeing earlier on. And you sh really shouldn't do it with a customer. But it's a little bit of a demonstration of how we could actually sit happen in a bad piece of sewing. So I'm actually um, uh, a potential purchaser, and he's a vendor. And he's got some software as a service. Everybody understands that? Software running on the web. And uh, I want to run the software uh, for my uh, um, travel agency business. Uh, would you like to make your statement as a vendor? Absolutely. Trevor, our airline booking software is web-based, and it's run as a service over the internet. So what? That means the software is run by us and not by you. Or, sorry, at our central server location. Mm, so what? That means we have the responsibility for maintaining it and not you. Mm, so what? Well, our costs of running the software are substantially lower because of economies of scale. Ah, costs. Let's have a T I R E S. It must be expense. Mm, could be. Uh, so what? So we pass the cost savings on to you. Mm, sounds interesting. Definitely an E. Uh, so, what other benefits are there from? running it as a central server? Well, we run a water-cooled, multi-processor, distributed computing grid Whoa. with dynamic application Whoa. management. So what? It means the software runs really, really, really fast. Ah, right, now this to do with a T. So what? Well, what used to, be, what used to take hours can be done